swimming tragedy in New Jersey. Two brothers, a 16-year-old Bayonne High School junior and his 19-year-old brother drowned in an indoor school swimming pool last night. But not before lifeguards desperately tried to save their lives. Eyewitness News reporter Derek Waller with more from Bayonne. Well, one of the brothers who drowned last night was a student here at Bayonne High School. His brother, a recent graduate. Today, we've learned that grief counselors are on hand. We also learned late this morning there were three lifeguards on duty last night, unable to save those brothers. It shouldn't happen. It, it shouldn't happen, especially it's not like there were two and three. There were 16 and 19. Right, they were sw they swam. Luann Beatrice told me the tragedy still doesn't make sense. Her kids are just a little older than the brothers who drowned last night at the Lincoln Pool on Prospect Avenue. To lose one son would be a horrific tragedy, but two at the same time and you know, no explanation. It's just, it's sad. Bayonne police put out this statement. According to witnesses and the three lifeguards on duty, the two victims were observed to be in distress in the deep end of the pool. As a lifeguard approached the deep end, he observed the two victims unable to resurface and entered the pool with the other two lifeguards. The three lifeguards were able to remove both victims from the pool and immediately began life saving measures as the 911 call was placed. First responders arriving shortly after 8:30, unable to revive the brothers. The pool located in this primary school is open to the public at night. In a statement today, the Bayonne School's superintendent writes, "Our hearts and prayers go out to the family and to all of our community." Adding that today they have additional crisis counselors and guidance counselors at all schools. And that pool is closed today as that investigation continues. Mayor Jimmy Davis says the family is asking for privacy.